Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Kev. Yes, super excited, as always, because I'm going to be going into the Clone Wars world and watching another arc. This time, I don't like the sound of it, mind, but yeah, this time it's a four episode arc and it's Crisis on Naboo. So yeah, I really have absolutely no idea at all what to expect in this one. Um, I know we were there recently on Naboo, uh, the Shadow Warrior, uh, where they had to do the, the swap over between Anakin and General Grievous. I think that was the last time we were on Naboo with the Gungans. Um, this one, Crisis on Naboo. I wonder what's going on there. I mean, I, what I know about Naboo, apart from it being like Queen Am Amidala is queen of the people, the Naboo people who were down on there. And um, I know that it was the best place of Palpatine, 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 depending on whereabouts in the country you see it with my accent. And uh, yeah, and the, it's the Gungans, obviously. That's their main place. So Crisis on Naboo. It can't, it's not good. It doesn't sound good. <laughs> it does not sound good at all. Uh, I'm not going to keep you waiting. This one is a four arc, four episode arc. So it's quite long. 15, 16, 17 and 18. Super, super excited to get into it. If you're enjoying the channel, hit the like button and subscribe. And I do put all of this, um, the Clone Wars and all of the TV shows and movies on my Patreon. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description somewhere. So yes, uh, I'm, I'm super excited. I'm just going to get into it. I can't wait. You know what I'm like? I just get super excited. I get too involved. Let's go. I don't like the thought of a crisis though. This doesn't sound very good, does it? Well, let's do this. A terrorist threat. Moralo Evol, mastermind of a separatist plot to kidnap Chancellor Palpatine, has been captured by Republic forces. Rumors swirl in the underworld of Coruscant that Moralo's plot has already been set in motion. What? The Jedi Council hatches their own plot to keep the Chancellor safe. What? Don't keep him safe. <laughs> so, what's the big rush? The Jedi Council has called an emergency meeting. <laughs> I can see it now. Another long, boring debate. Oh shit, son. Careful. Is he going for Orbi? He's the worst fucking sniper I've ever seen. <laughs> A sniper. I see him up there. I'm going after him. <laughs> wow, this is just kicked straight off. I love it. Hi right, boys, keep your head down. I lost him. What in the shit, Biscuit? Orbi just took one straight through the shoulder. Mate, that's fucked up, man. Orbi got shot through the shoulder. What did he walk out for? Fucking lunatic. How is he? Obi Wan. What? Obi Wan. Obi Wan! <laughs> So it's a setup. Yeah, they're gonna pretend that he's died. Oh wow. Go on, Annie. I'm worried about Anakin. Dude. <laughs> Sitting here, you're kind of going, hmm. What the fuck? I killed Obi Wan Kenobi. Heading down a dark path. We are. Killing a Jedi was the best move we had. It's Obi just chilling. Obi's just got his feet up. So, how was my funeral? <laughs> Better performance than you, your corpse gave. I was dead to the world when Anakin moved my body. There's no way he could know I was alive. Keeping Anakin on the outside was critical. No, dude. Everyone, it was his reaction that sold the sniper. I'm sure of it. We need to get your transformation underway. What the well, fuck? Time for a shave. Tell me about my target. His name is Moralo Ival. I think it's going to kick off. directly for Count Dooku. Any details that might help me gain his trust while in prison? <laughs> Ival told the authorities he did it because he was bored. Yes, and so are the rules. Obi-Wan looks about 10. Preventing Ival from abducting the Chancellor, he could <laughs> lead us to Grievous. <gasps> All right in your neck. Transformation. Oh, man, that's gonna fucking sting. Ah. 
Dude. Badass. So Anakin thinks he's dead as well. He'll go fucking wild. Your employer has your payment. Round for the house. <laughs> hey, you cocky bitch. We have your credits right here. We need one more thing. Obi Wan. Your clothes. What the? I love it. Love the fact he's going in pretending to be him. Might they come to a, a part where he has to fight him, thinking he doesn't realize it's Obi Wan? Confessing to a murder I didn't even do? How do I look? Like a criminal. <laughs> buy you all the credibility you need in prison. You can go to sleep now. Night, night, son. So, how does this vocal emulator work? Oh, I love these toys. I was going to go in his throat. You swallow it. I was afraid you'd say that. Oh, dude. Oh. Uh, it will take some getting used to. I hope this works. I mean, it, this is fucking brilliant so far. <laughs> oh, and he's gonna kick off. Where is Racco Hardeen? <sighs> Back room. He is gonna. He's gonna arrest him, isn't he? Is he dead? He's about to be. I already killed the Jedi today. Uh, let me sleep. Get up, you filth! If it was up to me, I would kill you right here! The man you murdered would rather see you rot in jail. Now let's go, you coward, before I change my mind. It is a very, very good move, but clever. But sneaky. Oh, I love it. He's going to jail. It's Obi-Wan. Let me know if he's any trouble. I'd be happy to straighten him out. And Obi's like, no. That's him. An Obi's killer. He doesn't look so tough. Kill the Jedi. That's the Jedi killer. Mm -hmm. You don't look so tough to me. Go on, Obi Wan. His food tastes terrible. <laughs> Maybe you taste better. What's going on down there? <laughs> Sorry. Just playing with my food. Ah, you're crazy! Lords of respect. Yeah, now he wants him on side. There he goes. I fucking love this episode so far. Oh, I love it! Draco Hardeen. What's up, son? I'm curious when you killed that Jedi. I don't know. Guess I was bored. Oh, he liked that. <laughs> I'll be seeing you, Mr. Hardeen. Because I was bored, so he's, he used that kind of... That psychology that he used before. Like, because he said, they, they said he said that as a child, didn't he? When he killed his mother. Quite addictive, this one. Oh, he's in there with him. What a coincidence. Mm, no coincidence. <laughs> Man like you, there's bigger game than Jedi. Chantilla. It's a brilliant plan, if I do say so. And it involves the Chancellor. <laughs> yeah, calm down. I'm breaking out this goon along with us. Uh, meet Cad Bane. Who you calling a goon? Any imbecile can kill. I can't. I can't. How's this sniper? I, I can't. I, it's you can't. Want my respect. You do it face. I love Cad Bane. He's one of my favorites ever. I want your respect. Him and Hondo. Make that triple, my race. <laughs> oh, what a shame. It's been a pleasure chatting with you, Hardeen. But you will forget everything you heard in here. Cad's then. He's involved in it as well. Of course he is. Fucking Wedge involved, isn't it? Cad's going to be involved. <laughs> I'm a dirty little bitch. Oh. <laughs> Cad loves it. Oh. This is Ben. I found the transmitter. I made contact with Evol. He nearly divulged his kidnap plot, but Cad Bane stopped him. <coughs> Cad Bane? We had no intel they were in league together. I believe Bane's capture was without purpose. Love Cad Bane. Do try to escape. I won't let them out of my sight. Just don't blow your cover. Hey, Hardeen. You owe me something. Oh, do I? Mm. You stole a bounty from me. Kill him, Hardeen! Like the Jedi! 
Oh, cuts involved. Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> Warned you. <laughs> no, it's eight. <laughs> you got a problem with Boba. You got a problem with me. It's like the lot's gone in here. Alright, that's enough, big fella. Like, I'm literally have I have me eye at me head. I can't even believe Boba's there as well. Get him. Now. The <laughs> oh wow. Out of my plan. It's a Boba. A little bit older than last time we saw him then. Let's go. Turn your weapons off, stun. Kill the prisoners if you have to. Whoa. Kill the Jedi. He could be helpful. Fine. We're wasting time. Ha ha ha, yes. Not the first time I've broken out of this stink hole. Hmm. Luck has changed. Yeah, yeah Orby's gonna get them out. I can get us inside. I'll rewire the access port on this door. Make it quick. If he looks different without his hat on, though, come on, people. We're in. The guards are coming back. Me too. Give me droids over this. After what just happened up there. Looks like a couple of them are showing vital signs. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Oh, I let him. Blaster jam. Careful. Oh, what a fucking kick in the head. I wish they had Boba as well, that would be even better. If they went along and they had Boba in there, Cad Bane. Cad Bane, what the fuck? <laughs> it's already one of my favourite arcs. Now of course, arcs were safe. <laughs> That's for hesitating during the escape. Oh, if it wasn't for me, we'd still be stuck in there. Yeah, funny how that worked out. Already got, he's already system out, hasn't he? Yeah, your ship's fucking off, son. Come back here. Maybe there's a place for you with my plans after all. I'm listening. I fucking love it. I have to ditch the ship. You mean you're going to intentionally crash us into the swamp? That is exactly what I'm gonna do. <laughs> you're dead. And then get out of there. <laughs> Cad's all fucked up. Nobody can trace us here. The swamp will swallow up the ship. You do have a plan. I know, Nahada. We can get a new ship at the Bilbao's Bazaar. We need to ditch these prison fatigues. I Mate. don't like to stand out. Mate, you stand out, you've got the biggest blue fucking head I've ever seen. You can see Cad Bane coming a mile away. It's local security. Keep moving. Pablo's pawn shop has everything a bounty hunter needs. He just wants his hat, doesn't he? Now all I need is a new hat. <laughs> I knew, I fucking knew it. It's all he's bothered about. There it is. That looks, that looks like a can be in trying hat. to blend in, your hat sure makes you stand out. Where can I get some quality blasters? <laughs> I wouldn't be too picky being on the run like you obviously are. Oh. I'd keep my mouth shut if I were you, Pablo. Huh. Alright then, pick a pack up, say a letter. That probably calling the huts right now, seeing what kind of bounty there is on us. Relax. On this slime pool, everybody's an outlaw. Besides, they'll be looking for three of us. I'll get the weapons. It's not the same to me. You crash the ship, you get us a new one. Oh, they've got like a proper good little argument battle going on between them two. I like it. As soon as we have a ship, we ditch Hardeen. Mm -hmm. Tell me, is this business or personal? Both. Both. Dirty bastard. Being a mercenary back then, a bounty hunter. 
Couldn't be able to trust any anyone. Eh, cheers, ball bag head. All right then. It's hey, where's my weapon? Won't need it. You're not coming. Yeah. He doesn't want to split his fee for breaking me out of prison. Oh dear. He despises you. Cheers, cut. Here's your reward. I'm not killing you. <laughs> oh, Cud, you're such a nasty little bitch. I hate it. I love it though. Smack them right on the forehead. You're a guest of the huts. My partners double crossed me, but I put a tracking device on their ship. Tell us the tracking frequency. We still a Jedi at the end of the day. My face might be changed, but he's still there. No more excuses, Eval. Time is running short. You said it yourself, Eval. You're free now. What is this? Who's attacking us? The engines are fried. We'll have to turn back. Shouldn't be a double crossing bitch. Their ship will crash soon on Nalhata. Our deal was you'd let me go now. Deal has changed. <laughs> I love that. I apologize for being out of communication, but the situation was rather tenuous. Have the bounty on us removed. If I can win over Cat Bane, I can learn more about Evol's plot. Do not contact me or send help. It's gonna go dark. I shall need enough credits to buy a new ship. Hmm. Why are you removing the bounty on the three fugitives? They could lead us back to Evol's operation. Very well. How can they expect me to just sit here and do nothing with Obi-Wan's murder on the loose? Oh. It is possible that they do not trust you to control your feelings. Oh, don't, 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 you slut. Ardeen killed my master, my best friend, and the Jedi Council won't do anything about it. The fugitives were last headed towards Nal Hutta. You cannot deny your feelings, Anakin. They are what make you special. Or day if you believe you can stop this plot against me, I trust you. Thank you, Chancellor. You won't regret this. No, I won't. Oh my god, he's so clever, isn't he? But he's got his finger in every pie. You missed me. <laughs> Kill me, and you won't get off now, Hana. Let the man talk. I've got a ship. You've got the huts on your tail, so you make me a partner in everything. First, I want to know where you got the credits to buy a ship. Huts owed me a favor. So you had them shoot us down? You would have done the same thing, Bane. We're even now. Get me <laughs> off this festering stinkhole. Now that we're all friends again, get me the fuck off this planet. Wait, who's going to pay for this mess? What makes you think Obi-Wan's murder is on Nal Hutta? I got a tip from the Chancellor himself. If you want to find a lowlife, you start at the saloon. <laughs> Where are we going next? <laughs> I recognize that little shit. They're bringing lords of the characters out here. Oh, he's angry. When did they leave? Nothing's free on our hunter, especially information. I don't have time for Nothing. games. You just missed them. Keep talking. I heard one of them say they just bought a ship. Let's go, Snips. Oh my god, Anakin's fucking angry, dude. Anakin's kicking right off. Sir, General Skywalker is Rex? unavailable. Anakin is on Nal Hutter. The council has a plan in place. I asked Anakin to take action. I suggest you have more faith in young Skywalker. They could have a proper fallen one-on-one, -on -one, couldn't they? If you must escort me home, I'm leaving now. Obi's gonna be yes, like, it's me, man. This is exactly what Obi-Wan didn't want to happen. Kill Hardeen. Skywalker might. Warn them both, you must. Overdue, the truth is. You think, son? Anakin needs to know now. Because he's going to lose this shit with Hardeen. 
been such an enjoyable arc this one so far. Look, it's Cad Bane. Who else wears a hat like that? <laughs> Good point. Now what? Jedi. Obi Wan's gonna be like, shit. You're not gonna get away from Annie. Whoa, man, fucking hell. It's my turn to kill a Jedi. Oh, he's really hard, isn't he, Cad Bane? Anakin's pissed off, though. not going to fail it though, he's just going to be blinded by his hate, isn't he? Oh shit, son. Proper crash landed. Anakin. Anakin's just going to be like, let's go, and he's going to be like, shit, it's me. Lightsaber. I knew this was gonna happen. You're going to pay. Shouldn't have gotten involved. This is for Obi Wan. You can thank me later, Hardin. Have your chance to kill him. Now it's my turn. What the fuck? <laughs> Punching him in the face? Anakin, don't follow me. Oh. Sips is covering his body. Ship is still operational. You're lucky we're in a hurry, little lady. We'll have to dance another time. So good. We'll have to dance another time. Master, Master, are you all right? What is it? What's wrong? Obi Wan is still alive. I I don't understand. I don't either. That this episode was fucking top tier, absolute top tier. This episode. Now it is here on the beautiful planet of Sereno that a barbaric contest will determine the fate of Obi Wan Kenobi. Barbaric contest? What the fuck? Dooku will smell him straight away. He'll sense Obi Wan. Used to be a fucking Jedi, man. Dooku, in person. Normally just hologrammed up, isn't he, the little slut? I apologize for my delay. Your careless delay could have ruined my plan, Nival. Who is the other one? We only succeeded thanks to Hardin. I thought he might be useful for the tournament. Enough small talk. For the tournament. That makes two of us. Both of you. If you would like to enter our friendly little contest. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm in if he's in. You already owe me for one job, Dooku. I assure you that if you survive the challenge, the reward will be well worth it. Whoa. Survive the challenge. Prepare the tournament. Yes, my lord. Prepare the tournament. This is getting better and better with every episode, this arc. Wrong to deceive you. It was. So I was right. Obi-Wan is still alive. A powerful Jedi. You are unpredictable and dangerous. You can be. Yeah. For Obi-Wan, on your patience, everything depends. Trust in Obi-Wan. We must. What the fuck? What kind of friendly little contest do you think the Count's got planned? Uh, this is anything but friendly. Nice hat. Hmm. Oh, where did you get it? He wants his hat back. There it is. 
pretty fast draw. Welcome to Sereno. You have been invited here Sereno. because you are the best bounty hunters in the galaxy. Embo, your bounty tallies were set Embo? only to one last season. Can Embo, be. I saw him Each fighting with Hondo. In a few moments, all eleven of you will enter what we call the box. What the, the fuck? The box. Some of you will not make it out alive. For those who do, we are looking for the five most skilled among you. You will, of course, be paid most handsomely. We will bring the Republic to its pitiful knees. Shut up, man. The box was designed by me. Enter the box. Cad. If you have the courage. An Embor. Cad. An Obi-Wan. What the fuck? This is so good. Wow. They say there is only one rule inside the box. There's no rules. There are no rules. <laughs> the point, my friend, is to escape and quickly. Dioxus, breathe it and you're dead. <laughs> that wasn't so hard. Oh, goodbye. Wow. The filters in my helmet can protect me for a short time. Yes, Obi. Jump down the hole and follow the tunnel. You got a better idea. <laughs> Cattle go. Next challenge. What took you so long? <laughs> He's such a badass. No casualties on the first challenge. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. That's a fair man. His brother got killed. I sense something different about that one. Yes. He killed the Jedi, Obi-Wan Kenobi. Obi-Wan Kenobi. He knows Obi-Wan very well. Right. You go around, it's like on the steps. There's a pattern to the blades. Just follow me in time you jump. Go. Keep moving. Yeah. Cat doesn't want to follow him. Oh, is he really gonna like start going on? Do you know what? I really trust you. This is so fucking good, this episode. That'll shoot out and he can get up. Ardeen has done it again. But let's see what happens when he is not the key to their survival. You must pass through my ray shield. Dude, you're gonna get your fucking balls cut off. The switch to turn it off is on the other side. The syringe on the platform contains a highly electrolytic serum that will allow you to pass through the shield. It's toxic to all but one of you. Toxic to all but one. Oh, da, 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 da. He's a par one. His blood can take the electrolytic syrup. Oh, he's gonna. He's done. <laughs> there you go. Just use him as a stepping stone to get over. I love it. Wow. Dude, man, that was so close. One, two, three, four, five. So there's six of them left and there's only five of them going to be taken. I used to kill Parwans for a living. Huh? Uh, 
Perhaps I should put Hardeen in charge of the mission. This was my plan. You have one last test to change my mind. Oh, damn, man. He's such a slut, isn't he? <laughs> I will show you who is weak. Oh my god, this has been such a good arc. Your sniper skill. Oh, hit the target. I show you how it's done. If we miss the target, this platform gets smaller. Oh, another night, another sniper rifle. Go on, Obi. Five more hits. Let's see how good you really are. Oh, wow. Go on, Obi. Out of charges. Oh, that's harsh. And your luck just ran out. What? So why would you kill us? I've done everything you've asked. Morolo Gonna kill him? Do it like a man. Yes! Do it like a man. Oh, shit, son. Go on, Obi. You're gonna have to do better than that. You, my friend, have seen. Nothing uh. yet. Let's even the playing field. Fucking wow. Go on, Orby, get him in the fucking headlock. That's a finisher. Finish him, Aki. Very disappointing. I just want to do my job and get my money. Congratulations on surviving the box. Tomorrow you will kidnap Chancellor Palpatine at the festival on Naboo. Wow. We will demand the release of all separatist prisoners. The operation on Naboo will be run by Cat Bay. All of you were forbidden now. <laughs> Obi-Wan travels to the planet of Naboo, where the Chancellor will preside over the Festival of Light. A deadly confrontation seems inevitable. We know where he'll be at every moment from the time we land on Naboo, and the stage itself will be sealed off by a ray shield for the duration of the event. With complacency comes vulnerability. It is what we do not see that concerns me. Obi-Wan will do his part. Let's make sure we do ours. Oh dear. Oh, Embo. Fucking badass. Hello, hello there. Well, hello there. All clear. This is it, my friends. The day of reckoning for the Republic. Execute your roles as you've been instructed, and you will all be immortalized in history, rewarded with enough credits that you will never have to work again. Wow. I'm only saying it once. <laughs> Each device tells you your position and essential details about your part of the plot. Two of you will act as guards protecting the Chancellor, Hardin. The assassin. Got a sniper. That's all you need to know. Once we have the Chancellor, the devices will lead you to the rendezvous point. Step into the Shadow Hologram and you will receive your new identity. What? A Shadow Hologram? What the fuck? How cool is that? I want one. Alright then. 
Get to your positions. Keep an eye on Hardeen. Keep an eye on all of them. Duke of the Slutsados, he's not. There he is. Dirty bastard. Greetings, your majesty. Where your safety is concerned, there is no such thing as overkill. So you keep insisting, Master Jedi. I've grown tired of discussing it. Shut up, man. You need to save your life, you prick. Ahsoka, welcome to the festival. That leaves the palace is the best opportunity for an ambush. Are you that certain an attack is imminent? Yes. I'm afraid so. Which is why I'm making Ahsoka your personal bodyguard. At your service, my lady. <laughs> if there's trouble, Ahsoka will get you, the queen, and the rest of your staff to safety. Yeah, so you'd think Dooku would be able to sense Obi-Wan, 100%. He'd be like, hmm, I sensed this presence before. Make sure you have two guards posted. Excuse me. I'm here in Theed. I've got a massive sniper rifle. Three of the bounty hunters are disguised as Senate guards. I'm supposed to immobilize the Chancellor, not kill him. In a tower overlooking the plaza. Make sure you have someone double check the guard's identity. I can say yeah. It's gonna take time. Whoa, man. Fucking hell. This, this arc has just been non stop. My head's gonna explode. Is that almost everybody in this? The stage is set. It is an honor to be here for this momentous occasion. And tonight, we celebrate that union. What's your identification number? SG-1984. Stay sharp. And look to never forget our past. East side. The security guard on the stairs. There it is. You two, take the Chancellor to that speed yep. and get him out of here. That's a setup, they've got him. This way, your majesty. <laughs> Bye. Oh. Oh, Yanni. It's only good for one shot. Oh, it only had one shot in it. Anakin's down, and I don't see Bane anywhere. I'll find it. Right there. Right, the Chancellor. <laughs> right. Whoa! You're coming with me, Chancellor. That is so fucking sneaky. The Chancellor, the guard escorting them is a bounty hunter. Huh. Chancellor, are you all right? <laughs> What? Where is the Chancellor? Gun. I've got him? Wow, man, that's mental. So long, Jedi. <laughs> if you've got a job to do, just give it a cadbin. I'm going after the Chancellor. Very, very clever how they did that. This is the rendezvous point. It was like a full on switcheroo. My plan worked to perfection. Uh. It wasn't your plan. Where's Dooku? I thought you said he'd meet us here. I don't want to be double-crossed and left behind again. Dooku's a no-show. The Chancellor's coming with me. Why would you do that? <laughs> Obi! <laughs> wow, he's gonna know straight away that you're someone better than that like, you're making out to be. Here's Dooku. Oh, it's not. Is that like an amaze? Yes! Take him and Bane into custody. You did a good job, Obi-Wan. Kenobi. I should have known. You tell something him. smelled wrong about you from the start. <laughs> yeah. Spending so much time with you was no reward either. Reward? I'll give you a reward mm -hmm. when I plug you full of laser bolts. Such a pleasant fellow. I hope this was all worth it. Once again, you have all distinguished yourselves in the eyes of the Republic. It's all part of the job, my lady. Oh, look at the little smile, uh, little Annie there. It's all part of the job there, love. Sure. Now that the threat has passed, I think Anakin is all the security I need. 
You look terrible. Being a criminal is not easy work. If I had known what was going on, I could have helped you. It was my decision to keep the truth from you. Your decision? Look, I know I did some questionable things, but I did what I had to do. You lied to me. Oh. How many other lies have I been told by the council? Oh, it's just stuff. How do you know that you even have the whole truth? The sown the seeds of distrust in the council. Shit, son. Something Anakin said has me worried. Do we know the whole truth? I need to check one last thing. Yes. Does something not right? Something not right with it, is it? Dooku was listening. He knew all along. We will leave as soon as Queen Neatney's banquet is over. In you, Dooku the slut. <laughs> I must say, the lengths the Jedi will go to is nothing short of incredible. I assume the brilliant plan to disguise Obi-Wan Kenobi was yours? No, it wasn't, sir. Interesting. I was under the impression the Jedi always worked as a team. Oh, Dooku. Welcome. My gracious. It's a trap. Stay back. Oh, stay back and just electrocute your fucking head. You should have quit while you were still alive, Dooku. Defeating you alone will be an easy task. Holy shit. Come on, Annie. Show some fucking skills. And goodbye. So elegant, isn't he, with regards to how he's like his Jedi skills. As he's like his hand behind the back. It's like he's fencing. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? That has been so good, man. Yes, Anakin. Um, no, Anakin. I hit fucking six bollards on the way past. Oh, <laughs> winded much, son. Are you all right? Come on. Well done, Master Kenobi. You are a worthy adversary. I cannot say the same about your young apprentice. <laughs> He's got a lot of respect for Obi-Wan. Here, Tanakin. Are you alright? Thanks again to the heroics of the Jedi. As long as I live, no harm will ever come to you, Your Excellency. Oh. Mm. Well, here's to your long and prosperous life, Anakin. One shudders to think where the galaxy would be without the Jedi. Dirty bastard. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Fucking hell. Wow. Oh, okay. So that was four episodes, uh, episode 15, 16, 17, and 18, season four. Um, absolutely amazing. Probably one of my favorite arcs, I must say. I mean, I know there's a lot of arcs out there. I don't know whether it's because of the length of it, because you, you, it's almost like the length of the full movie. You sit and watch them all. Um, I just, everything about that was kind of what I like. Um, I didn't see many clones die, <laughs> which is a, a, you know, you know me. It's a big, uh, it's a big thing for me. To see, yeah, uh, to see no deaths of any clones. It's good. Um, kind of the just the way it had to be, the way the, the way that he had to disguise himself. He had to pretend that uh, that he died, and they didn't even let Anakin know and Snip know. So he had to kind of fake his own death to go in undercover into prison um, to, to kind of gain like the trust. And then to see Cad Bane there um, was unbelievable. And then they had to break out, and then they had to go to. Uh, that they get put in, in this competition to see who could like uh, to see who, who had the skills to lead the team to capture um, the Chancellor. Uh, just everything, and I also noticed um, they seemed to kind of in that arc they must have gone. How? Let's just hire everyone in just for the fun of it. Go on, get on. I even mean we we saw even like Shark T and Master Plo, um, all the way to Bail Organa. 
all the way from your all the all the the, the different Jedi. So it seemed like they've they'd gone. Ah, go on. Yeah, but who else is there? We haven't seen Shark T for a while. Go on, how you're in. You know, and and I love that. It was just, it was just a wonderful arc all the way through. Um, it absolutely flew over. Really exciting. Really entertaining. Um, so I'm gonna have a quick look at what's next. Um, on here you'll be able to see. So, uh, you probably saw the TV light up in my face. Light up there. So I've got the big TV there. So the next arc is uh, the return episode 19, 20, 21, and 22. Now we do go into a series of about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The next seven arcs are um, are four episodes each. So yeah, there's some pretty impressive arcs coming up, I guess. So the return is next yeah but overall i mean I, I found it hard not to enjoy everything about that episode um yeah and obviously palpatine again you know he's just he's, he's just a slippery little bitch and how he's how he talks to anakin and sows the uh, the seeds of distrust with regards to you know to the jedis and what they get told and you know maybe you're not getting told and uh, and he's like and what else are you not telling us and it's just kind of sown those yeah, the seeds of doubt of that, that the, the Jedi who they say they are. Um, obviously, we know where it all leads into and stuff. So it is good the fact that they, they, they are kind of trying to touch on that in this show. It's very, very clever. Um, oh, wow. I mean, I can just... That, just the thought of that episode was brilliant. Um, yeah, easily. Probably in probably my top... Easy in my top five arcs that I've seen. I loved it. Uh, and I just can't wait for the next one. I just want to say, you know, if you have took some time out today, and I will put some links for other ones that I've seen, but if you've took any time out today to watch this with me, uh, you know how I feel about it. Uh, I just want to say thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for just spending any time, you know, to, even if you just popped in to say hey, you know, uh, it, it means that the absolute world to us. So I just want to say thanks again, and yes, I'll see you soon for the next arc.